Now we're going to set a custom color. You see we're on the C menu with our preset colors, but what we're going to do is we're going to hit the menu button and we're going to shift it until we get to U. So there's P, there's five channel, there's our custom. Now we hit enter and we have to set our red color. In my case, my menu calls for red nine. So I'm going to hold the up button. Once I hit 100, it keeps going and it'll go right up to nine. Next, we're going to hit the enter button. And we're going to hit our green color. So for green, I want 34. Here is green coming on to 34. And we hit the enter to store that. And for blue, I want 96. So I'm going to hit down until I get to 96 and hit enter. Just to check, red 9, green 34, blue 96, enter. At this point, the presets are stored into the light for the U menu. So if you accidentally shift over to another color, you can come back to the U and hit enter and it'll go back through your custom set and you reset back to your custom color. Also, if you unplug the light and plug it back in, when you plug it back in, it will be set to the custom color you have just created.